So, let's talk that elephant in the room. The way I talk in these videos. You, you'll probably notice that I kind of stumble and have this very casualized, not sure of myself tone, or like I don't know what I'm thinking of next, and yeah, that, that, that's just because of how I make these things. See, I don't script them. I'm just thinking off the top of my head. Now, I rehearse what I want to say. It kind of makes me seem like I'm talking to myself, but really I'm just rehearsing what I want to say, kind of like when I rehearse conversations, because I don't want to be... I don't want to be speechless at any moment. I think part of it is that since I was a film major, I had to do a lot of essays and god i just really hate writing essays like i basically ran out i was just <coughs> i was like dry like i had nothing else to say and i just i, I would because i would i would try to write them and i'd be up until 4 a.m the day that they're due just getting whatever i could out on the page and it really just affected my writing because I'm more of a creative writer than an analytical writer, it's easier for me to just write stuff in a fun, in ways that sound fun and entertaining than it is for me to write things in a professional academic space. For videos like these, I perp like I really tried not to have them scripted, because if I had a script, I would always be looking at the script, and I want to be talking t into the camera. You know, so that there's that connection. Because I'm trying to talk to you. I'm not trying to talk out of the paper. And plus, I'm not very good at even reading off paper. Because I have this weird way of, like, accidentally misreading things. Like, the letters will be mis... Like, I'll mix up the letters, or I'll just mispronounce it. Like, I think I did so in the uh, Devil Summoner 3 video that I made. I mispronounced Raido's last name or first name, however the Japanese do it. Not that it's his real name. The... A fine barbecue establishment. And, like, I... Because when I talk, like, when I've read aloud... I always read faster than I should, and I just end up tri going reading too fast, and my mouth gets really dry, and it, like it starts to hurt. I don't even like talking too much, because when I do, it dries out my mouth and it hurts. So like it hurts me to talk for so long. I mean, one of the benefits of these videos is that I can take pauses and then just cut those out, which is why I sometimes jump. Because I don't want to waste your time. I mean, even reading in general, not even just reading aloud, reading is difficult for me. Like, it takes me years. Like, I've been re reading the Dark Tower series, and I'm still... That's book five. I'm still... I've been reading that for, like, two years. Out of the four years I've been reading the series. Because I just... God, I hate reading. This is why I like movies and TV shows and video games is their visual mediums and I don't have to just read the words because I'm looking at something that has movement and dynamics in it I'm not just looking at still images on a screen or a page that's my other issue when I'm talking sometimes I'll use I'll straight up use the wrong words even though the meaning of what I'm saying is basically the same like, I'll say, run up a ladder, even though no one can do that. It's climb a ladder. But if you heard me say that, you would get the meaning. Although, there has been instances. The worst thing I've ever said was because of a word jumble like that. That's not exactly something I can share with you people. Not in a video. In person, I would just tell you, because I love talking to, about myself. I don't, it's not that I love it, it's that I do it easily. Like, if you just ask me a couple questions, I'll just answer. 
and I might end up giving you my entire life story and it's like way too personal. But I don't like to write down my videos. I don't like to write down the scripts of my videos because it's like I've already done them. And like I wrote it already, I don't want to keep doing it. I don't want to be reading off of something in a video. I mean in the gameplay videos, technically, like the review ones, I could have had those written down beforehand, but I just chose not to because I don't have the time to do that because my process of these videos is kind of similar to like married couples and with kids having sex because my parents are still home and I can't seem to work when they are at home so I try to get as much done when they're gone plus also fitting in all the video games I play because we have a living room base house and the good TVs in the living room. So whenever they're not home, that's when I'm scrambling to get all my work done. Like I'm doing this right now and they've got an hour until they come home and I'm like, oh boy, I wonder what else I can record today. And then I won't get a record for two days. And then I might not record until next Monday. I'm recording this on Monday. See, this is what happens when you don't script your videos. I mean, you can script if you want to make videos that's fine I just I don't like doing it because I really hate writing essays the only things I like writing are stories or creative joke essays such as uh, the movie I'm working on I guess I haven't really been writing it because I took a screenwriting class and I really disliked the teacher and she kind of ruined screenwriting for me since I had to write an original screenplay in like five weeks and that is not enough time <sighs> that was crap it's really bad I mean when I do write essays I don't like I'm a very much a vomit draft person because they say, do a vomit draft, get everything out, and then go back and revise it. I hate revising. I'm more of a, get it out the best I can first. So, like, my writing process takes worlds longer than everyone else I know. Because I'll just be sitting at the computer, trying to think of the best, most eloquent way to write a sentence. And then I'll write it, and then I'm stuck. Because I don't know how to write the next one. It got to the point where I couldn't even be at the computer anymore. I just had to be sitting by myself on my bed with the, my wireless keyboard and I'd just type it off the top of my head. And so that's kind of how my writing works now. It's every, all my writing is vomit draft. And that's, that's just the way I get what I have to say out. Sure, it might not be the best sounding or the best academic, but it's the way it works for me. And if you're a fan of this channel and these videos, then I guess it's not too bad. Called a stylistic choice. Dickies, please give me money.